everyone, it's Willowheart here. Hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we get into today's video, I would like to mention some things about my channel's growth. k plus subscribers man we're going through the roof and i mean it when we have 30 percent more viewers than usual in the last 28 days nice guys keep up the awesome work you may willow here very proud to have all of you supporting the community however i do have to mention one thing that needs to be resolved and fixed it's awesome that the subscriber rate of plus 766 which is an 87 percent increase as epic as it is the subscriber bell notification alert is pretty low. What's great about it is it instantly lets you know whenever I post up a content and booms my channel and its recommendation to a higher spot, especially currently my impression rates, which gets to my videos onto the recommendation page. Already currently, I have about a 1.4 million impressions with 47.3% of YouTube recommending me as it is. So please, 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 if you want to help me to get a higher number and get my content out there for everyone to enjoy, please hit that bell icon and hit all notifications so you can better support the Willow community and myself. Thank you again for your love and support. Now with that out of the way, let's get into the video. Now, I know the majority are here to hear about the all-popular, all-adored comic dub that helped me get to my channel where it is, and that is The Wings of Fire, The Lost Air. Don't worry, we will have a separate video about our plans for the project. Right now, we have important things to discuss about the future steps in the Willow Heart channel. Now, you might have read my post about this, and I've been thinking about it for a while, even before hearing the 10k subscribers. As you guys know, my channel is all about one thing, creative stories, comic dubs mainly, to be short, as folks love a good comic dub. Heck, I do too. One of my favorite channels that does a great job with this is Phantom Savage. This guy's a legend. I listen to his work like a kid at a candy store, drooling over some good juicy content. Another channel is Ruka Samuels. She does comic dubs as well, with one of her examples, My Dear Cold-Blooded King is a heartstring turner with amazing voice actors she has in the team. <laughs> Are you scared? <laughs> He's so beautiful, I love his voice. <laughs> what these channels have related is that they have a team or pattern set of comic dubs works they do. Now, I really want to do something similar by having a good sized team to get some amazing comic dubs done for all ages to enjoy, not just children. My first attempt at story building would have to be the Worry Cats, where I did PowerPoint animation, and it was decent enough to start building up the channel. So, after a month of thinking and pondering this for some time, if I wanted to get more comic dubs out significantly, yet fun, thrilling, and rewarding for all to enjoy, I'm going to need your help to make this a reality, and that it is... Project Willow Heart Studios. So, the YouTube channel name will change, but a lot of the interface will remain the same with a new channel trailer to really sell what my channel truly is about. Now you might be asking to yourself, what is Willow Heart Studios? Well, I'm glad you asked. Like I said, this will be where a new team dedicated to get fun creative comic dubs done, mainly revolving around webtoons. By the way, webtoons is a really great awesome website that you can actually go into and read some amazing comics. And go over there and support your favorite authors. Comic dubs we do on there like Sub-Zero, for example, and you can also find many more that we will probably do for this channel. We will even do audiobooks as well. Now, you know, I tried to do a Songbird audiobook, but I felt like that tie wasn't ready as the channel needed more development and more support before pushing that. Folks generally prefer visual looks instead of audiobooks, but many also prefer audiobooks for the joys of listening and being in the moment. That's why now that we hit 10k subscribers and the support has grown, my confidence in audiobooks has returned and now I want to try to get something like this. Stuff like perhaps Wings of Fire Darkstalker, many books like Peter Rabbit, and much more. Now for the teams I need and not just voice actors, 
I can't direct all said projects, as I listed, and I need support and trust, especially trust to get the work done, with dedication and responsibility. So, we will be seeking directors, which will be in charge of the project with this editors and voice actors. I may even open doors to welcome social help in getting the Willowheart Studio more into public. So, in the description, you will find the poll to vote on stories. The top four or five will be worked on first, with the director selected will be in charge of. That's all for me for today's video. Again, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Like, hit that bell icon and put on notifications so you don't miss anything. Have a great day or night, and see you all for next time for Wings of Fire, the Lost Air update video. See ya, and stay safe during these troubling times. Doodles.